So guys, I marked this baking stock on the macro I'm going to use on it. So where the arrow is pointed is where I marked. Alright, but that's not where I'm going to cut. That line is not where I'm going to cut. So watch. This arrow is showing where I marked. Alright, another arrow will come again right now. Now, the second arrow is showing where I'm going to cut. You know why I'm giving that space? It's because of the wet. It's very simple. Just understand this video through the illustration I'm giving right now. Alright, so this is it. This is what we're going to do. This is what we're going to do. We're going to cut it outside the line because of the wet. I promise to show you guys how to wet baking stock. So that's what I'm doing on this video. Alright, so just follow the way I'm explaining it to you. You get it right. It's not hard. Okay, there's not much. This video is not too long. Alright, so this is it. Now we are done. So as you are wetting it, all right, you've already placed your baking stock on the line you marked. So where you are wetting right now is where you left. You understand? Is the space you add. I don't know if left is right English, but it's the space you add. All right, so that's where you are wetting. So you can understand what I'm trying to say. Okay. So after everything you cut it close to the line and bend and push it inside hope you have your glue around then you glue it after everything okay so you see how it looks the middle is where the baking stock is and the side your left is where the wet is all right so what else are you going to do make sure you put your glue on where you mark as in where you cut i mean so it will come together okay then after everything you file all right so that's it guys thank you for staying by to watch this video please like and subscribe